China's 2024 Stimulus Package, Global Impacts and Implications for India China's latest stimulus package, introduced in October 2024, aims to counter economic stagnation by focusing on three main areas, boosting liquidity, supporting the struggling real estate sector, and revitalizing consumer spending. The package includes monetary measures such as cuts to interest rates, mortgage rates, and banks' reserve requirements, along with policies to encourage home purchases by reducing down payment requirements. Additionally, there are plans for fiscal initiatives, including cash transfers to low-income families, aimed at stimulating domestic demand. The immediate impact has been a positive response in the stock market, with Chinese equities experiencing a significant rally. The measures are intended to alleviate deflationary pressures and support asset prices, although there are concerns about whether they will be sufficient to overcome long-standing structural issues, such as high household debt and a weak property market. Analysts suggest that while the stimulus may help stabilize the economy in the short term, it will not necessarily trigger a robust recovery without deeper reforms, particularly to boost consumer confidence and address underlying economic imbalances. Globally, the package could influence demand for commodities, especially benefiting countries like Australia and South Korea that are closely linked to China's supply chains. European luxury goods and tourism sectors might also see some gains if Chinese consumer spending rebounds. However, the US is expected to see limited benefits due to ongoing trade restrictions and technology bans. The overall effectiveness of the stimulus will depend on China's ability to sustain growth and implement structural reforms that go beyond short-term financial boosts. The October 2024 stimulus package from China is valued at approximately CNN 3 trillion, around $411 billion USD, making it a significant economic intervention aimed at addressing growth challenges. The package's measures, which include interest rate cuts, liquidity injections, support for the real estate sector, and upcoming fiscal transfers, are designed to provide short-term economic relief while encouraging consumer spending and stabilizing key sectors. For developing economies, the impact could be substantial, especially for those that rely on China as a major trading partner. The potential effects include Commodity demand increase, developing countries that export raw materials, such as Chile, Argentina, and Indonesia, could see higher demand for commodities like copper, iron ore, and oil, driven by a recovery in Chinese construction and manufacturing activities. Julius Baer China Briefing Supply chain revitalization, Southeast Asian countries, which are deeply integrated into China's manufacturing supply chains, may benefit from increased industrial activity. This could boost their exports of electronic components, machinery, and other industrial goods, stimulating regional economic growth. Tourism and consumer goods, if Chinese consumer confidence improves, developing nations that are popular tourist destinations, like Thailand and Malaysia, could experience a surge in tourism. Moreover, increased demand for consumer goods, especially luxury items, may benefit countries supplying these markets. Gulf Times. However, there are risks if the measures only provide temporary relief or if debt-driven growth leads to financial instability in the long term. Developing economies may face volatility in commodity prices and supply chain disruptions depending on China's economic trajectory. China's 2024 stimulus package could have a mixed impact on India. 1. Commodity price fluctuations, as China ramps up demand for raw materials, global prices for commodities like metals and oil could rise. This might increase import costs for India, which relies on imported crude oil and industrial metals. Higher import prices could worsen India's trade balance and inflation, potentially complicating the country's economic management. 2. Opportunities in manufacturing and exports, India's manufacturing sector might benefit if increased Chinese demand boosts the global supply chain. Indian exports, particularly in sectors like textiles, pharmaceuticals, and IT services, 
could gain from stronger regional economic growth. Additionally, if China's domestic supply struggles due to ongoing economic issues, Indian manufacturers could find new opportunities to supply goods to both China and other global markets. 3. Geopolitical and Trade Considerations India and China have complex trade relations, characterized by competition and cooperation. The stimulus may not directly benefit India if Chinese policies prioritize domestic companies and supply chains over foreign imports. Moreover, the ongoing geopolitical tensions, including border disputes and trade barriers, could limit the spillover effects of China's economic rebound on India. 4. Tourism and Consumer Goods Demand If Chinese tourists increase travel to neighboring countries, India could experience a tourism boost. Additionally, China's economic recovery might support demand for Indian consumer goods and services in sectors like luxury goods, education, and health care. Overall, while India's economy could see some positive effects from increased regional demand, the benefits may be tempered by inflationary pressures and geopolitical considerations.